welcome back it is now officially the 11th week of university last weekend was halloween weekend which was so much fun i'll enter a small clip right here about two and a half weeks until thanksgiving break so there's a lot that needs to be done before then i have tons of papers i need to submit before i leave for fall break today and tomorrow i have really busy schedules so i thought why not vlog it all today i have two lectures one at two and one at four and then right after i have an event for my fraternity phi alpha delta um it's labeled as a speed date but it's really like just to match your big little which if you're not familiar with greek life it stands for big sister little sister and it's basically like a mentor mentee situation so yeah i'm gonna go to that and then before i go to my lectures i want to stop by my campus union so i can register to vote i attempted to register online but it didn't work for some reason so now i'm gonna attempt again and go in person so that i'm able to vote next tuesday for the midterm elections if you haven't registered to vote already and you're of age please please do and even if you don't have time to register before the day of election which is november 8th you can actually go in and register on the day of voting so yeah there's really no excuse to not be able to vote if you're of age and you're in college and if you are planning on voting or thinking of it which you should be you should before voting day search up all the information about your district your state and anything regarding the candidates that are running um in your area oh by the way i got airpod maxes i've been wanting these for so long but my brother surprised me and gifted me these i'm so 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 grateful they're so good i've been using them literally like every hour of the day here's what they look like also recorded the unboxing so i'll enter that right now I ordered these clear protective cases because I just didn't want to risk scratching them and I also did not like the noise they made when they clanked. It was like a nails on a chalkboard. So yeah, I will have these on forever. It's currently 11 so I'm kind of tight on time but I'm gonna go downstairs and eat really quickly, come up, get everything I need and then we're gonna head out. So here's my outfit for today. The skirt is from Brandy Melville, and my top is from Zara. It's super hot today, so I didn't want to wear pants. And, I mean, I wanted to dress nice for my fraternity event also. So, yeah, that's the fit. I'm going to make a matcha latte, and I'm going to show you guys how I make it. This is the matcha I use. It's like three bucks. I'm going to add some cinnamon. Or add the tiniest bit of water and you just want to mix it and then you're gonna add your sweetener of choice this is what I use and I just kind of do two spoons of that and you get your cup of ice and your milk I'm using oat milk we're gonna pour this on top look how pretty that is and then you have your matcha latte. That is so good. It's so much cheaper than going to Starbucks. Okay, I'm about to leave. I changed into pants because I wasn't really feeling the skirt.
ended up actually voting because the guy just gave me the ballot, but that's cool. So to talk more about my voting process today, here's my sticker. Today I went with the full intention of just registering to vote. I didn't really know the process and I didn't know how long it would take. I'm freshly 18. I turned 18 this past summer. This is my very first time voting. So I didn't have any clue about it. In my mind, I was going to go in today to register to vote and then on election day, I would go in and then cast my vote. Yeah, registering to vote took like five minutes maybe. And then the guy printed out a ballot for me and just told me to pick any polling booth and just cast my vote. So that's exactly what I did. And yeah, that was so easy. I was out of there in like 10 minutes and I made it early to my class. So if you are worried about registering to vote or voting, taking up a lot of your time, it literally is so quick and easy. Don't even worry about that. The only piece of advice I will give though, however, I've mentioned this before, please, please, please research before you go vote or even register to vote because most likely you will vote the same day you register to vote if you are registering to vote in person. The thing I've picked up on is that a lot of people my age have a strong misconception that when you go and vote, you are only voting for the major things, but that's not true. You are also going to be voting for the smaller categories and most likely you are also going to be asked to vote for a certain specific positions such as like whether or not you you agree to pass a certain bill and so yeah those are things that you really want to research and know before you go and make a decision whether or not you say yes to it actually know what you're voting for and make sure it aligns with your beliefs and your political values that's all i have to say we won't have class on tuesday so i hope everybody goes votes and then you have a really really good voting day okay because only four mentors showed up so now I'm just gonna go back to my room It's Friday. I am running late to my class because I found it so difficult to get out of bed this morning, but we're going to try to make it on time.
night so i didn't really vlog a lot today but basically i came back and finished some assignments and i get ready for my bands tonight if you don't know what a bands is um, I think it's like pretty popular amongst like all universities. Dance for a barn dance, so you just get taken out to a barn and it's basically a party in a barn. I don't really have like country outfits and I don't have a country hat, so I'm just gonna make with what I have. Okay, so I've just done my hair. I just did two pigtails. Nothing crazy, but I think it fits with the theme. Um, I'll show my outfit in a little bit, but right now I'm gonna do my makeup really quickly. I'll just show you guys when I'm done. Here's my outfit, and here's my makeup. So I just have this shirt that I got from Depop, a skirt that I thrifted in Seoul. I have a brown belt to make it more country. And then I'm just wearing my boots that I always wear, but I have to zip them up. Quick change of hair, but I put it in these little tiny loops, and I think it's so much cuter. <laughs> Oh, that's a...